गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द क्लास आई एम डजनी योर साइंस टीचर इन दी ए वी पुलिस पब्लिक स्कूल कैथल वी आर ऑन द चैप्टर ट्रांसपोर्टेशन इन लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स ट्रांसपोर्टेशन इन एनिमल्स टेक प्लेस बाय द सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम वी हैव स्टडीड अबाउट द हार्ट एंड इट्स पार्ट नाउ द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट पार्ट ऑफ द सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम इज ब्लड blood is the fluid medium that help in transport of different material throughout the body blood it is made up of components these are the components of blood blood plasma rbc white blood cells and platelets the first component of the blood is blood plasma blood plasma is a liquid component of the blood that normally hold all the blood cells it makes about 55% of the body's total blood volume the function of the plasma is to carry the nutrients different blood cells and different hormones throughout the body and the second component of blood is rbc that is known as red blood corpuscles these red blood corpuscles are red in color because of the protein molecule hemoglobin hemoglobin gives red color to the blood hemoglobin transport oxygen to the different part of the body therefore it is also known as respiratory carrier the blood is red in color due to hemoglobin and the transport of oxygen and carbon dioxide take place by the hemoglobin this is also known as respiratory carrier the next component is white blood corpuscles these white blood corpuscles they help to fight the blood with the harmful bacteria and dead cells these white blood corpuscles act as the defense force of the body they protect the body against the germs and the body against the infections these white blood cells fight with the germs and kill them the next component of blood is platelets the function of the platelets is clotting of the blood they are they prevent the excessive loss of blood from the body part so the function of the blood is to transport the digestive food from the small intestine to all part of the body they carry oxygen from lungs to the different cells of the body they transport the waste material and remove it from the body the blood cells wbc help in fight against the infection the clotting of the blood is needed to prevent an excessive bleeding by the platelets the blood this is also maintain the body temperature 